I wish you a very happy weekend. Uh, I'm recording this in advance, as you probably know, because all of us are on the spiritual retreat cruise to Cuba. And uh, I can say, even though I'm talking in advance, we're having the time of our lives. In Colossians 3, verse 14, it says, Above all these, put on love which binds everything together in perfect harmony. All of us have a deep-rooted longing, even a need, a deep soul need for harmony in our relationships. And yet it's only when we establish peace within ourselves that we can infuse our relationships with harmony. I'll never forget, I had a woman in my office one day, and she was uh, so angry, she was beet red, she was sweating profusely, she was shaking uncontrollably. I'll tell you, I was concerned she was going to have a heart attack. And I asked, finally, I said, what would you like to pray for? And she said, what I really want is peace. Well... I've never forgotten that because if you want peace you have to become peace you have to become your prayer what you're praying for don't pray for something you're not willing to become and we talked about it for a long time after that and she was not willing to become peace all she was willing to have is revenge. Well, we have to establish peace within ourselves to have harmony through daily communion with God. This is ever increasing in our lives, in our minds, and in our bodies. We will be filled with love, will be filled with peaceful thoughts, and then from us, like a fountain, love will flow automatically from us to bless all people and all situations. We'll be able to handle any situation in a loving manner because we are so filled with love, that's what we are. And we'll have an understanding heart. We'll release any need to prove our personal will as we look to and trust the harmonizing power of God. Harmony is established in us, and it automatically flows to all of our relationships. We are open channels through which God's love finds expression. That's the way God's love comes into the world, through us, if we're willing our presence calms the disturbing situations and we live and we work in harmony with everyone. I pray today in a new way, in a magnificent way, that you become a radiating center of God's divine harmony.